So you're considering moving to Florida from California. Well, in this video, we're going to go over the reasons why people are leaving Cali right now and moving to the Sunshine State over here in Florida. Now, this is coming from somebody that actually lived in both areas and currently lives in Florida. So I'll give you my little insight and the key reasons that people have told me while they're making this move. So stay tuned. What's up everybody? This is Tim Whittemore with the Whittemore Group right here in the Destin Fort Walton Beach area here in Florida. If this is your first time to our channel, we do tons and tons of videos about everything you need to know about the Destin Fort Walton Beach area. As a military veteran of 14 years and now a military spouse, I've moved tons of places. And every time I moved somewhere, there was always such a lack of information of where to move to and what to anticipate. That's why we created this channel for you. So go ahead and hit that subscribe button Click that little bell so you're notified every single time we got a new video coming out. Honestly, we get phone calls, emails, and texts every single day from people that have questions that are moving to this area. And well, we absolutely love it. So if you are moving to this area and you need some help, again, give us a call, a text, email, heck, send us a little paper airplane, <laughs> whatever you need to do. We got your back when moving here to the Destin Fort Walton Beach area. So what we're gonna talk about today is why people are leaving California specifically and coming on over here to Florida. Well, as I had mentioned before, <laughs> I actually lived just north of Sacramento for a couple of years back in like 2009. And since uh, 2012, I've actually been down here in Florida. And I can tell you some of the difference and quite honestly, I, I love both of those places for different reasons. However, at the date of this video here in 2020, I'm going to talk about a little bit of things that people had mentioned to me that have moved from that area or plan on moving and some of the great things and differences between the two. So without further delay, let's go ahead and get into it. First is why are people leaving? Why are people leaving California right now? Well, first thing is housing costs. The average house cost out there in California is upwards around 648 thousand dollars and that is of course a, of the date of this video the average house price in the united states is around 184,000 right now next is the living cost well the best way that i can put in how to compare these living costs compared to the rest of the country is on a scale or an index for the cost of living so that's just taking a scale from one to 100 and 100 just being the average of what the normal family is going to pay for cost of living throughout the United States, okay? So in this case, the on the index, uh, average in California is around 163.9 out of 100. So that's that's about uh, 60, almost 64% above the national average. Now, the next reason is, well, taxes, <laughs> they're among the highest in the country and they're rising. This is coming from a guy that used to live in New York as well. Uh, the state income tax is 1%, so you have that. You have a personal income tax of around 6% for people that are making between 31,000 to about 44,000 a year. Now, if you're above that and you're around 56 to, well, 286, that's quite a big gap, you're at 9.3%, that's quite a big, a big jump right there. Uh, you also have sales tax at 7.5%, and your per you also have a couple of other things in here, such as your personal and property taxes, which of course are pretty high, and they also have this inheritance and estate taxes in California. Okay, so why are people moving to Florida? Let's talk about in contrast for what I just told you. Let's talk about housing cost. Your average for housing cost here in Florida is around 285,000 for a single family home. Again, as of the date of this video in 2020. Uh, your cost of living, let's talk about that index. Again, national average being 100. Even in our area of Destin, it is 118.6. Now that is 18% above the national average, but I mean, you get to live on the beach here. <laughs> Comparison to California, that is 27.6% less. So 
there's one big reason for moving. Uh, let's talk about the taxes. First things first, does Florida have a state income tax? No. Does Florida have a personal income tax? No. <laughs> Starting to sound pretty good, doesn't it? All right, sales tax, 6% versus your 7.5% and your personal and real estate taxes. Now, this is typically a little bit higher than your national average is just because they don't have the two first taxes that I was just talking about. They typically get their revenue from sales tax and uh, property taxes that make up the lack in, in those uh, revenue chains, if you call it that. Uh, still, <laughs> it's still a lot cheaper than California. Oh, what about that inheritance and estate tax? there's none here in Florida either. So you're already saving a whole bunch of money just by thinking about moving to Florida. <laughs> All right, so other pros for moving to Florida is obviously our beaches are better. Well, I guess that's debatable, but I think that it is. Uh, the climate here, well, most of it is always kind of tropical. You get about farther north California, it gets a little bit cooler there. Um, that's kind of where I was at, I guess it's central. I don't know, you people from Cali can judge me. Um, <laughs> and also, great Mexican food. Oh wait, no, that's totally California. Uh, sorry, you guys got that one. Florida needs to step up their uh, Mexican food game. <laughs> all right, well, that's all that I do have for you, uh, why people are moving from California to Florida. If there's something that I missed, which I'm sure that there is, please leave it in the comments below. If you have any questions about anything that I specifically talked about, again, leave them here in the comments below. But if you are moving to Florida, even if you're not going to our area and you need some help and you need, you need a, uh, a trusted person to help you in your transition over there, reach out to myself, reach out to our team. You can give us a call, text, or email. We're happy to help out any way that we can to get you over here to the Sunshine State. So again, I'm Tim Whittemore with the Whittemore Group right here with eXp Realty, and we'll see you in our next video. Take care.